Hey, Oak Folk. It's Pastor Chris. Just a quick update ahead of our Sunday gathering on the 14th of August. You know, everyone is kind of in a transitional uh, time. Uh, the end of summer, some people are getting their last summer activities in before the start of the school year. Um, some folks are headlong into the school year. So um, wherever you're at, um, we, we hope to see you on Sunday. Um, it, it's been fun to uh, re-enter after sabbatical. It was great to see everyone this past week, and I know uh, we'll see more folks that we haven't seen for a while this week for our worship in Potluck. Um, right now, as I'm talking, it's Friday morning, and it is uh, it's just strange weather. We, we just had a, a rainstorm, but then it looks like it's it's gone, and now it's going to heat up. And this Sunday, we'll explore a passage from Luke 12, and Jesus talks about uh, the weather um, to illustrate uh, the ways that we discern what God is doing in our world. Um, so I really look forward um, to getting into a uh, maybe difficult or confusing passage together, um, but also singing, praying, and sharing our potluck meal. Um, a few things to look forward to coming up. You'll hear, um, and there's info on the email, about a possible opportunity to be part of an Oak adult kickball team this fall. Uh, Kayla and Nanny is gauging interest, so if you're interested, um, contact him and he'll share a little bit more about it on Sunday. Um, and then some things coming up, including our fall kickoff, the last Sunday of August, the 28th. Uh, that Sunday, we will have our blessing of the books. So think about something that you might want to bring to um, signify uh, and symbolize uh, this new season to lay down, um, ask God's blessing and presence, um, and then we'll take it back up um, uh, as as we've um, dedicated this coming season and um, and shared. Uh, what our hopes, what our fears, what our anxieties, um, and what God might be up to uh, together. Uh, that'll also be the Sunday in which the age groups move up. So we have some kids maybe moving up from the younger Godly Play class to the older. We have some kids entering our youth group, which is fifth grade and older. Um, and so you can talk to Pastor Meg or talk to Brody um, about that um, and just look forward to it. It's something that we get really excited about um, uh, with our own kids. And um, I look forward to seeing you soon. Take care.